I could run hydrogen off this Ryobi uh, two cycle. Um, only thing that you're missing though is an oil input uh, to lubricate the piston. Um, and you need valves on each end. This is the intake. This is the exhaust. Take that muffler off and put a valve on each side. And uh, um, you can still keep it as a two-stroke, two-cycle. But you're going to have to drill a hole and add a, an oil gallery to this head. Um, there's got to be an oil pump in there somehow that sprays in oil. Or you could add it here at the valve. You could just like put an oil input here at the valve. And pretty much run hydrogen off of it. With solar panels. Your solar panels can produce your hydrogen if you have enough solar panels and then they got machines that will produce that for you in various states of chemistry whether it be with sodium sodium hydroxide or salt or water just plain water or whatever you produce enough hydrogen you could run this sucker produce your own fuel and it wouldn't really matter you know all you have to do is have spare metal rings and rebuild it every now and then and buy a few little parts and you wouldn't have to worry about creating your own energy so as long as solar could produce enough power to produce enough solar panels and repair solar panels so there's a ratio for that you know say one solar panel could produce a thousand solar panels uh that's pretty fucking good you know it's a one to a thousand ratio in in effect in efficient energy